Fast. Fast. <sighs> I'm not sure the sound is working. Wow. It works. Uh, this is a little awkward for me, but if you found this, then that means... Anyway, if you could try to deliver this video recorder to my home. That's in Haventon, 27 Arbor Street. It's right in front of the park, and, well, uh, maybe, just maybe, someone will be there. Okay, this is basically my life. My backpack, climbing harness, flashlight, a couple of batteries, a pistol. I've never even fired a gun before. Anyway, there aren't any bullets in it, so... I can't believe I'm about to arrive. It's been almost a year now since the event. It only took me four hours to fly out east. But the better part of a year to walk home. With any luck, I'll be back at our apartment in another couple of hours. I saw a lot of damage on the way here, but this looks different. There's more dust than anywhere I've seen. I wonder what it looks like inside the city. I know it's crazy, but I, I just have this feeling that I'll find you. Julie, without you and Mary, none of this makes any sense. Almost home. See you soon. We have to go now because of the earthquakes. The evacuation team is waiting for us. We'll be taken to one of the emergency shelters. It's very hard to get precise information about the evacuation plan. I have no idea where we'll be in the next hour. If only you were here. I would tell you that I forgive you. For everything. For now, all we can do is pray that you're alive. And if you are, I know you'll come back here. We'll try to stay in Haventon, but we'll go wherever's safest. With Mary, I can't take any risks. We love you. Not a moment goes by that we're not thinking about you. Try to find us. We'll be waiting for you. Julia Mary, May 23rd. May 23rd. That's almost a year ago. Sorry that you've had to go through all this without me. Earthquakes, dust storms, then what came next? The food shortages, hunger, thirst. Where could you be now? This year was so long already. While I walked back, I was thinking I was just hoping to find you standing here. <laughs> How could I? Mary! No! No! Alone. She doesn't have anything you want. <laughs> Look what just wandered into the spider's web. Got it. Hold up! Hold up! You ain't got much ammo. None of us. Back this time. You made a big mistake. I won't hurt. You promise? Yeah, I promise. Come on out. I have something to show you. What's your name, sweetie? I'm me. I have a daughter almost the same age as you. Here, you can take it.
You're safe now. Um, here, take a look at this. It's okay. Take it. You see that? That's me. What did you do to them? Uh, them? I made sure they wouldn't bother you. Linda? Linda, are you there? Why won't you answer me? Henry? May, thank God. Where's your mother? Mommy never came back. Where are you? Are you all right? Yeah, I'm okay. I'm with a nice man. Man? What man? Let me talk to him, sweetie. Um, hello. What do you want? What I want? I want nothing. <coughs> Look, man, I know the score. All right, I got food, water, batteries. You bring me the girl, you'll have what you need. You got it? Ah, uh, sure, man. I got it. Listen, the little girl doesn't look so good, and I think we're about to have a storm. So we need to get off the street. Where are you? Uh, close to State Street, near the Arboretum. Then get to the mall. It's probably the safest place for the time being. Come on, sweetie. We gotta go. You were bad. Yeah, and guess what? I've got medicine for you. <sighs> May is resting now. I managed to find her the medicine she needs. <sighs> she reminds me so much of our Mary. I'm sure they'd be good friends if only. <laughs> Henry! Henry! May's fever has gone down some. I think she's okay to move. We need to get out of here. Okay. Bring May to my apartment. We use the subway. If you take her out in the street, she'll just start coughing again. There's no one here. I don't like it. But May seems to know the place. You there? Did you make it? May, can you hold this for a second? Yeah, we're here, as promised. You're an honorable man. So am I. Your stuff is on the table behind you. Is May going to be okay here? Where's her mother? I don't know. I wish I did. Anyway, thanks for your help. You're free to go. All right, May. Looks like I have to go. Can you give me my toy back? <laughs> Look, you sure she's going to be okay? She just lost her mother. Well, actually, there is something else you can do. We need you to get something for us. Get something? A radio transmitter. A radio transmitter? Why can't you get it yourself? Isn't that pretty? <gasps> Henry! Henry! Because... I can't. Henry! Is it my birthday yet? No, sweetheart. Not yet. <laughs> hey! Did you get it? Yeah, I got it. Good. Now we'll finally have a chance to respond to those messages. <clears throat> Come over here. I need to talk to you about something. I found May's mother. You did? That's great. <sighs> it's not great. She's probably at the hotel. The hotel? What's that? Well, uh, it's not a vacation. And if she's there, it's against her will. Are you talking about my mommy? Yes, sweetie. Just give us a second, okay? Do you mean she's being held for... When is my mommy coming back? Soon, sweetie. Your new friend is gonna go get her right now. Aren't you? Henry's right. I'm leaving right now. What do you want from me? Want? I don't want anything. I'm just here. Don't come any closer. Don't touch me. Don't even think about touching me. Hey. Look, I'm untying you, okay? No problem. Who are you? I'm a friend. I don't have any friends. I'm with May. May? My daughter? You've seen my daughter? Where is she? Don't worry, she's safe. She's with Henry. And I'm here to get you out. Okay, whoever you are, let's go. I think I know how to get us out of here. Oh, my baby girl. Mommy. I'm so sorry, May. I promise I will never leave you alone again. You promise? Yes, baby. 
I promise. Yes. Yes. Well, you were right, Henry. There is a ship out there. Did they say what they're doing? Why they're here? They've been searching for survivors. I knew it. Well, tell them we're ready to go. Come and get us. There's a problem, though. The fog is making it impossible for them to get too close to shore. They can't risk running around. We'll have to create a beacon, or, or something to guide them in. A beacon? How are we going to create a beacon? How about fireworks? What? Fireworks. I have a stash left from last New Year's, right before the event. Fireworks! Fireworks, yeah. Hello? Hello? Henry! Linda! Meg! Hello? everywhere for you. I'm so glad you're okay. You came for me? Of course, sweetie. I wouldn't leave you here. Now, come on. Let's go find your mother. Okay. Watch out. It's flooding. It must be caused by the quakes. You found me. Thank God. Mommy! 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 You found her. You're a miracle, <laughs> you know that? When nothing else in this world works like it's supposed to, you, my friend, are a miracle. Uh, I don't know what to say. Come on, we should go. The boat's coming. Right. Time to go. Are you coming? No, May. I'm not. But why not? I just can't. Not until I found Julie and Mary. I left them once before. I can't do it again. Besides, Henry's still out there, and I'll bet he needs my help. Then take this to your daughter. She might need it. <sighs> Thank you, May. I'll make sure she knows it was from you. Thank you for everything you did. Take care. You'll find them. Julie. It's gonna be okay. If you're still here, I'll find you. I promise. I... I'm gonna find a way to make it up to you. 